Y'all know nothing about this. You need to pay attention. Sit back and relax. It's time for Goodall's Country Kitchen. We're here in Boston Harbor to get some lobster and chowder at James Hook and Company. All right, you local Bostonians, don't click out of the review because I swear that's the last time I'm gonna use my cheap, atrocious Boston accent. Okay, and except for we had to pack the car. Okay, but anyway, that's it, I swear. All right, we're here to get the famous lobster rolls and I, we did a lot of research and this place was at the top of the list. So uh, we're gonna get two different kinds. You get the kind, uh, the hot one with the butter or the cold one with the mayonnaise. I couldn't decide, so I'm gonna get both. All right, we're gonna go in here and check it out. All right, taking a look around up here. You see you gotta line up and go up to the counter and place your order. And they have live lobster well here. You can get lobsters anywhere from one and a half pounds to three pounds. 177. Pick out your own lobster. But we're not here for a whole lobster. Y'all know what I'm here for. Fresh clams, different assortments, oysters. Oh yeah, that's the real deal. Also, you see they got the crabs and this is soft shell. Man, it's thousands of lobsters in here. See that? Menu board. And then they have the deli case for fresh fish, shrimp, lobster. Yep, right off the boat. All right, as I said, I couldn't make up my mind which one was the best. Lobster roll, so I got both. I got one with the butter, which I'm gonna start with this one first. It supposedly had butter on it, but I didn't think it had enough. So I asked for extra butter. And I don't know what kind of bread they use, but I like the bun. It's got, uh, it's grilled. It has plenty of backbone in it. So. why these things are 35 and 40 dollars a piece the flavor is amazing people back home Louisville you're never gonna get anything like this we got fresh crab meat straight out of claw With butter all over my short. All right. Usually don't uh, have alcohol in the videos, but I'm here in Boston Harbor. I gotta wash this lobster roll down with a local IPA. It's called Harpoon. Oh. Perfect flavor mix with that lobster. All right, I'm gonna come right back, work on this, and then we're gonna get on the next one. All right, so now we're going with the cold one with the mayonnaise. Okay, see they're humongous chunks of lobster. That probably came out of about a two pound lobster, I'd have to say, it's just full of meat. So here we go, double snapping turtle and anaconda required. I'd say almost as good as the lobster is that bun. That bread is incredible. And even though it's cold, I'm gonna pour my leftover 
hot butter on there. Mm. Amazing. Melissa hates these for abuse. She's behind the camera right now, motioning for me to wipe my mouth off. All right, we're gonna work on this, and then I've got one more item, and then we're gonna wrap it up. All right, last item, the clam chowder. And it's pretty thick. This is not like any clam chowder I had. I remember when I was down Siesta Key, it said the best clam chowder in the world at that, uh, what was that place called we went to? Captain something. Captain Kurtz. Captain Kurtz. Yeah, that's it. Old Eagle Ears over there. All right, here we go. What did you say? Did you just hear what he said, Bob? What did you just call her? Did you just say, bruh? <laughs> <laughs> this is very good. I can see it's got chunks of clam in there. Very tasty. Not only is the uh, lobster rolls great, chowder's good too. This is a small, by the way. You can get three different sizes. I think the largest one is a quart. Very good. It's got the potatoes in it. Cream. And it's thick. I guess they cook it down like a reduction and thicken it up. Now, here's a little something. I don't think they make these, but I got a couple of these for the kids. These chocolate whoopie pies. People were grabbing them right and left, so I had to get one. Mary saved me a couple bites of hers. A couple bites, I thought you said. Really, Dad? You didn't want me to eat the whole thing? Did it again. Look at Kenzie, got the butter just dripping down her chin. That's the way you know you enjoy it. All right, everything was great. Go wrap it up, go see some more sights. And y'all don't know nothing about this James Hook and Company.